<laughs> Off to a good start. Uh, hi, Hobie. We we're trying again. Uh, the Adventure Bot. What is Adventure Bot? It's just telling stories with an AI. There's a prompt round. There's a voting round. And whatever gets the most votes is what gets sent to the AI. And the AI gives us a response back. What's up, Mr. Seeker? What's up, Creation? Hi, hi, hi. Happy Sunday? Hi, happy Sundays. Uh, we could get started here with the story real quick. Oh, here we go. Not yet. Not yet, Mr. Seeker. Too soon. Here we go. Let's get started with stories. Submit your prompts. There you go. Submit your prompts right now. All right, everything's running. Nothing's broken yet. You have tw two minutes to submit a prompt instead of one minute. I might bump it to three. We'll see. We'll see. You are a walrus banker named Philip K. Mr. Underscore Bye. Seeker submitted prompt. AIPD submitted prompt. Okay, Mr. Seeker with a lust story, me with a weird, <laughs> fat, anthropomorphic walrus. Uh, creation, if you're... I don't know if you've seen this yesterday or not, but we've got Adventure Bot. It's a new thing. You could submit prompts. What's up, Hubble? Hi, ho, wee, wee. Happy Sunday. The 7 THS Age submitted prompt. Thank you, 7th Sage. What's up, 7th Sage? Oh, yeah, we never got to do Jelly Juggernaut yesterday. so uh, And then we all vote. So Very democratic. Very interactive. Ties are still broken by whoever submitted first. So Maybe not the most ideal, but... Uh, I was fixing more important stuff. So it should tell you too, like round updates in Vote chat. Vote for your favorite prompt. There you go. See, so it tells you in chat right away. So as soon as you see it in chat, even though it might not be on screen yet, you can vote. Uh, same with submitting prompts. It'll go to chat first. And if there's a stream delay, keep your eyes on chat for K9000. Yeah, let's. I'm curious. Jelly Juggernaut's a good, good name. Oh, and it looks like Twitch is in the red already. So, oh, man. I'm still live, though, it looks like, but frustrating, to say the least, to try to have an interactive show, but have Twitch fuck up all the time. We're working on it. You are a jelly juggernaut, a jelly-based superhero with a massive, mounded body. Okay. Your mission is to defeat. Generating response. Monomorphatron, a monomorphic Monomorphotron. alien who has infested the planet's super weapon with his swarm of jelly creatures. All right! He has Hello. a telepathic link hey, with a fly he carries. Cyber Shepard, a transhuman who created the Translator program to convert um, other cybernetic life forms uh, into his cyber army. Um, he cannot resist the lure of the Translator and the power that it bestows upon him. Um, suck a slobbering slime. Suck a slobbering slime. <laughs> Um, I don't know how I feel about uh, tra transhuman could be like sub or but I don't know what it's going for there. Like, tra uh, uh, oh boy, submit your prompts. Okay, here we go. So we got mo what's monomorphic alien too? I guess just one. One jelly guy? <laughs> yeah, I have no idea.
No, transhuman means cyborg. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, so my mind went there, but transhumanist. Uh, okay. You suck. A slobbering, slobbering slime. And transform into dot dot dot. AIPD submitted prompt. I also made it so if there's only one prompt, it doesn't go to the generate round. It will stay here until there's at least two prompts. So don't worry if you're still thinking of a prompt and there's only one Mr. prompt. Mr. Underscore Seeker submitted prompt. The 7 THS Age submitted prompt. Ah, okay. You glide into Cyber Shepherd Lair and wobble very angrily. And then Mr. Seeker trying to start a very weird B story about Poopy Diaper Patrol. I guess, you know, we haven't specified what the uh, Jelly Juggernaut has to do on a daily basis. What is a superhero anyway? If I if I help people with incontinence, Missileite am I still a superhero? Prompt. Hey, what's up, Misha? Creation come undone submitted prompt. Ah, okay. Yes, a lot of Vote good ones. Vote for your favorite prompt. Vote for your favorite prompts now. Hmm. The slobbering slime turns out to be Slimer from Ghostbusters. Okay. You charge your cybernetic slime. <laughs> I'm torn. I don't know. You can't vote more than once. One vote per user. I should have vote counts like in this. I don't know. So if you could see if there's a chance, you like if suck something's a slobbering only... slime and transform into <laughs> you a suck a slobbering slime. See, I'm so dyslexic. A lumbering boulder with two massive grappling hooks for hands. Your mission is to defeat Monomorphatron, a monomorphic uh, alien it. who we has infested it. the planet's super weapon with his swarm of jelly creatures. He has a telepathic link with a fly he carries. Oh, Cyber Shepherd, a transhuman okay. who created the Translator program to convert other cybernetic life forms into his cyber army. Oh. He cannot resist the lure of the Translator and the power. Okay. I love that an evil villain has a telepathic link with a fly. That's just, that's so funny. And it doesn't really, like, normally. You're like second in command is some lumbering big uh, creature or something. But a little fly is very funny. Submit your prompts. Uh, I guess a little fly would not have a problem with Super Jelly Monster. Okay, so also... As the Jelly Juggernaut, we transformed it. So we're a boulder with two grappling hooks for arms? That seems... <laughs> it seems like a problem. I guess we're like... Uh, what's that Overwatch character? The, the hamster or the ball? Hamtaro? <laughs> or uh, I don't know what his actual name is, but... Hammy the Flying Hamster. Uh, I guess, yeah. You look for the whereabouts. Creation come undone submitted uh, prompt. Monomorphotron. Bulk Bogan Mobile submitted prompt. Oh, yeah. Bulk Bogan got it. Grapple hook my way to Monomorphotron's HQ. I like that better. You charge your cybernetic fly swatter. Okay. I mean, are we the good guy or the bad guy? I guess superhero implies that we're working for the side of good, but. 
I need to know. What's... The 7THS age submitted prompt. Why is Monomorphotron trying to take over? And couldn't we use more jelly in the world? I wish I had interrogate. Uh, I'm not going to be able to spell it. Mr. Underscore Seeker submitted prompt. Vote for your favorite prompt. All right, voting time. Your first target is Monomorphotron. You giggle your way into the jelly cannon and shoot yourself into the enemy's UFO ready to fight. Oh, I like that. We do have grapple hands. I do want to use my grapple hooks. And I do want it to remember about the grapple hooks. Uh, it beholds. You start to attack. It's not very effective. Okay. Yeah. Face the final boss right out the gate. Why Why are we uh, Why are we hesitating? Monomorphotron's right there. He's just like so cocky that like who would attack me? I'm Monomorphotron. And we're like, Grapple beep, beep, hook motherfucker. my way to Monomorphotron's HQ. Generating response. Okay, here we go. Find out where the jamming device is. Destroy it and drive Didn't the jamming device back to Cyber Shepard's position. Didn't preventing the translator a... program from gaining access to the translator army. Okay. Let's do this. You jelly juggernaut, infiltrate the planet's super weapon and destroy the jamming device. <laughs> the jamming device. I am device. now going to send oh, you like on a, a series of missions jam, which will take you to device. various parts of the planet, the location of which will appear on the map. Okay, okay, all right, this is setting up something bigger. Oh, sorry to hear, Amagana, but what's up? Yeah, the perfect stream to lay back to while you're sick. It's just, it's very lax. We don't have bright flashing colors or nothing, so. All right. So now we've set up like, uh, submit your prompts. We've set up trilogy bait. We've got missions all over the world. Uh, your first mission. Mr. Underscore Seeker submitted prompt. Is to. Missile life submitted prompt. Bite jellies. In the Congo. And take out. I can't even remember his name. Monomorphotron. Creation come undone submitted prompt. Fly. And number two in command. AIPD submitted prompt. In the form of an X, you should try to fly through there. Omogona Throw some strawberries and sugar prompt. into the jamming device and make some sweet jam. I like that, Misha. You go to Brazil and meet all your fans there. Okay. Uh, eat the sussy. <laughs> okay. The 7 THS age submitted prompt. Oh, huh. Uh, the first location in the moon. You need to jump into the active volcano in Yellowstone in order to travel to Cyber Sepper's moon base home. Okay. <laughs> I like the moon. And the moon would make sense for a jelly based life form. You just floating around, being all jelly-like. You don't need gravity holding you down. Gravity keeping you on the ground. Hell Vote no. Vote for your favorite prompt. <laughs> I do just like the... Th this is like a superhero story, but we're just making strawberry jam. Oh, Mr. Seeker, what? Vote 
Negative one. Uh-oh, I don't know what that does. Mr. Seeker, you might have found a, a bug here. Or I think I think I might have, if it's not a number. I don't know, but that is a number. Oh, interesting. I, I did not account for this. But it registered your vote as something, Mr. Seeker, so you're negatively overflowing something. In the form of an X, you should try to fly through there. Uh, oh, it tied. I didn't Generating get it. response. To do this, you will need to transform. After each mission, you must choose which form you will transform into before flying back to HQ. Okay. I am going to give you some forms now that will help you complete the mission. Each form has its own abilities and capabilities. We are going to give you three forms, a gelopular, a boulder, and a slobbering slime. What the fuck is a gelopular? Let's see if you can defeat the monomorph by transforming into these forms. Oh, I, this is like setting up a video game. Gelopular. Gelopular. No, that's not a thing. I, I, my first thought when I heard that was like a jelly helicopter, but that doesn't really make any more sense. Submit your prompts. Mr. Underscore Seeker submitted prompt. Bulk Bogan Mobile submitted prompt. I like that. Yeah, what's whatever a transform into gelopular. Ah, here we go. Creation going one beyond. Oh, well. Uh, uh, exclamation, exclamation, prompt for this one, creation. Uh, it did not register, but I do like that. I'll put it in here. AIPD submitted prompt. Creation come undone okay. submitted prompt. Omogona 22 submitted prompt. I can remove my duplicate. Turn yourself, turn into a secret Gundam from Jello Popular Man. <laughs> Jellopular Man. I could see that being Missile an Missile submitted prompt. Oh, Tamisha. Autocorrect. Jalapular man. Misa's in horny jail. Well, yeah. I mean, if if people vote for it, then that's the way the story's going to go. Hey, what's up, Duke? Uh, exclamation, exclamation prompt, Duke. Vote for your favorite prompt. Not too late. Oh, and also, my... My uh, my countdown is off by five seconds, so uh, just a heads up. If I don't know why that is, ah, uh, shit. There is a five second. I wonder if I could fix that. Uh, I'll leave it for now. Horny Jail is a prestigious academy. Okay. Uh, transform into Jello Opular. Yeah. Uh, I'm torn between the middle three. I do like number four. Secret Gundam Jalopular Man. What could it be? And it should Transform be Transform into Dildo. So it's off by five Generating seconds Generating response. Time. Unscrew your head, get inside, and transform into a hammering great dildo. 
You see you would have what? to penetrate Monomorphotron's palace your hammering great dildo is now ready to enter the Monomorphotron's palace and destroy the jamming device. Wait a second. You enter I the palace, oh, a maze I think of I rooms, up. doors and corridors, you see the jamming device in the distance. You smash the jamming device with your hammering great dildo and... I think I messed up. I voted for number four, right? Did, did the dildo one win? Wow. I guess it did by one vote, yeah. Yeah, Misa with three votes. Melgo Megatrildo. Yeah, okay. You penetrate. Yeah. Uh using some dildo vocab. You're hammering great dildo. Dildo always wins. Yeah. Submit your prompts. Here we go. Submit your prompts now. Creation come undone submitted prompt. Turn on the vibrate function. Yeah, <laughs> let's take this out. Duke 1102 submitted prompt. We split votes accidentally. Oh, oops. But it turned out okay. Yes, it's the great hammering dildos. Somehow is it was exactly what we needed for the situation. Fart into a glass jar and close it airtight. Oh, someone's trying to do some uh, butt huff. Omogona 22 submitted prompt. I don't know if that's an old wives tale, but butt huff is like when old... Uh, Missile life submitted prompt. <laughs> I don't know. I, they don't need to do this. When homeless people shit into uh, Ziploc or, or like uh, like Tupperware containers and then they leave it out in the hot sun and then apparently like ferments or something i don't know and then they huff it really quick and it apparently gets you a little bit high i don't know if they actually do that shit but it's so funny that's that's jankum oh yeah jankum yeah i think that is it but i don't know if it's true but i mean if you're homeless the and you have no money for drugs age submitted prompt you might as well try it, in theory it makes sense that sounds like an urban legend but I mean, well, you can huff duster, and that would have the same effect. It's just like uh, you're huffing so much that's not oxygen that it gives you a little high. Jankum is a real drug. I tried it. I highly doubt you've tried it. Uh, but I guess it's easy enough to try. Mid-journey is great. Oh, yeah, let's see this. Did you generate an image, Duke, up based on... Is this an art or something? Let me look. Vote for your favorite prompt. Yeah, mid journey is pretty sweet. Oh, that looks cool, Duke. I don't know what this is, but. A caco demon patrolling through something. Interesting. The depths of hell. Yeah, wow. Uh, uh, turn into a dildo Gundam Triforce. Penetrate the palace more. <laughs> uh, you emit a great bream from your hammering dildo. Oh, I like that. Yeah, let's get some. Laser dildo. All those, if this just turned into a Jankum story, where it was all in our head, and we're just sitting on a park bench, like... Turn on the vibrate function. Generating response. Interesting. The jamming device Three starts votes. vibrating and emits a great crackling noise. You hear Monomorphotron on the other side of the door making a very different noise. As he calls for his fly, you hear a hissing noise, and suddenly the door is opened by a monstrous fly. It is the fly which has been carrying Monomorphotron's telepathic thoughts. The fly is electrocuted and Monomorphotron turns on you. <laughs> yes. It is huge and has two. Uh, Jason, we're all, we're all horny here. Uh, I guess, yeah. Um, wow, I cannot believe the dildo killed the fly. I'm not surprised, though. I mean, it should be able to. A vibrating dildo a giant, could, should be able to kill a giant fly. I'm just, you know, I'm just shocked at how effective it was, you know. Alright, so now the fly's out of the way. I don't really know what the fly... Submit your prompts. I guess the fly... We probably should have interrogated the fly instead of killed the fly. If it knows everything Monomorphic Trine knows. 
like a weakness or something. You know, hindsight's always twenty twenty when you kill a fly with a giant vibrating dildo. Generating some mid journey image related to AIPD right now. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Duke. Missile life submitted prompt. Okay, Misa, that's too sexual. <laughs> as much as I would like to, we we gotta. We can't make it that Duke sexual. Duke eleven oh two submitted prompt. Uh, Omar right. twenty two submitted have. prompt. Uh, <laughs> it has literally nineteen eighty four. Sorry, Babisha. I can't. I feel like semen's one of those trigger words that's going to make it go graphically sexual. But if we say massive balls, if we keep it ambiguous, we can't. We can't just go straight there. I'll leave the massive balls, but The seven THS age submitted prompt. Okay, two massive eyeballs, even bigger than your dildos, form balls. He tries to kill you with all his tentacles as you weave and bob. Okay, I like that. Jason's got all PD. P, he'll, he, Vote now for your favorite I'm not prompt. successful, so I don't know what you're talking. I have a small following at best, but it's good. But I would not say successful. You've got more subs than me than I got zero. You know what? That's a good way to. Uh, that's a good way to look at it. I have more than zero. And five of them were I gifted though. Massive so. eyeballs, even bigger than your dildo forms balls. He starts trying yo kill you with all his tentacles as you weave and bob. Generating response. To avoid his attack, you see a spider climbing the wall behind Monomorphotron. You swing your hammering great dildo and smash the spider off the wall. He okay. drops down and tries to attack you with his long, sharp legs, but you are too quick for him and destroy him with one swing of your hammering great dildo. Hey! The next thing you see is a giant yellow-eyed dog. It has huge teeth and appears to be attacking you, but it is actually trying to bite. I mean, that's just like a street dog, right? That's, that's not evil. I mean, it just might have rabies or something. I mean, we defeated Monomorphotron and his telepathic fly, so... I would say mission success. I don't know. Do anybody want to get an epilogue or do we want to start a new story? I'll leave it up to you guys. Submit your prompts. New story. Or do we want some closure on Monomorphotron? Jason's saying that like rabies aren't a big deal. Well, they're not like a world-ending threat, though. Creation come undone, submitted prompt. Okay, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get some closure with this dog, I guess. P pet the dog. This dog is our new sidekick or something. Uh, rabies is actually very serious. And you could die if you don't get it treated. And, like, you gotta get it treated right away. So you don't fuck with rabies. If you see an animal with rabies, you shoot that thing in the head. I understand why they had to kill old Yeller. Right? That's what he got? He had rabies or something? You don't want to see that shit suffer. And it goes like it goes right to your brain. I'd rather have COVID than rabies. Yeah, I think that's unanimously true. Omogona 22 submitted prompt.
pull out your laptop and download life hacks and get multiple porn viruses. Viruses from porn or porn viruses where like tits the are flashing The 7 age submitted prompt. <laughs> okay. All right. You're giving the credit to the dog. I like that. Monom uh, Sikkim boy. And the dog kills Monomorphotron. Interesting. Oh, here we go. Let's see. Thank you, Duke. Whoa, cool. Let's see the other one. The other one just looks like it has firecrackers in its ears. <laughs> I like this, though. Let me, uh... Vote for your favorite prompt. I could show this. Yeah, that looks cool as hell. Thank you, Duke. <laughs> that was very cool. Ties are broken by whoever submitted first, so. Yeah, I should have the vote count on this page. Hold on, let me add that as a to do. To do. Add running. Vote total. On vote page. Pull out your laptop and download life hacks and get multiple porn viruses. How did I know that was going to win? Generating response. From the internet. I now want you to defeat all the jelly creatures Monomorphotron has released on the planet. Ah, we forgot about that. If you destroy that. them, oh, the you handsman. will not be able to transform into a jelly creature, so you have to be quick and have to adapt to the situation and try to destroy them with your hammering great dildo. One of the first jelly creatures you see is a little ball of jelly. You throw your hammering great dildo at it and crush it to a... What the fuck? Five days and I've already used 50% of my mid journey computation quota nice i mean it's fun there's plenty of uh like stable diffusion services and stuff out there now like there's night cafe and then there's uh there's some other stuff here i'm in like a ton of discords uh there's Submit like your a stable diffusion itself discord 130 images not bad Do we want to start a new story? We got our powers from Monomorphotron? <laughs> yeah, interesting. Monomorphotron is our dad? Yes, new story. I'm satisfied with the story. Okay. All right, let me save that. Uh, we need a Dr. Ranger up story. Well, here we go. Uh, hold on. Let me fix this real quick and see if there's like an error. Uh, one sec. Let me change this real quick. And it seems like they were all off by five seconds, so... Let me just do this, minus five, minus five. Five. You know what? I don't know. Hmm. Well, let's try it and see what happens. All right, here we go. Submit your prompts.
Submit your props for a new story. Duke 1102 submitted prompt. All right, here's another range up on. Omogona 22 submitted prompt. Creation come undone submitted prompt. AIPD submitted prompt. Uh, Dr. Raindrop is back. He wants you to take over the world again with his new and shiny teledynamics technology. You are Big Jumba, a notorious CSGO hacker and have downloaded some anime waifu cheats in a CSGO surfing server, but the people are angry. You are Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior of mankind, or so they think. Ooh, I like that, trailing off. And I have you are Golden Tusk. You are now working for Raindrop Industries as uh, dot dot dot. A simple factory hound. The seven THS age submitted prompt. You are Dr. Raindrop. You are trying to create the most evil device yet. A worm Vote that will for erase your favorite prompt. all porn from the internet. Oh my god. How nefarious. Hmm. Yeah, I do like that is quite the stakes. Very high stakes. Dr. Raindrop is the son of Dr. Raindrop, right? Okay, yeah. The mis you gotta go with those misspellings. Yep. <laughs> the the nurse, he was going to be Dr. Raindrop Jr., but the nurse just wrote it down wrong, and that's just his name. And they were just too lazy to change. There's like, there's too much, there's too much inventing going on here, too. You are Dr. Rainder Zero B. You are trying to create the most evil device yet. Yeah, A worm that will erase all porn from the internet. Oh, God. Generating response. You don't even need to be an expert in electronics to do it. But you need to make the worm undetectable. Ah. Your task is to choose the correct set of random numbers to make the worm undetectable. What? You will be given a reward of 1,000 points if you choose the correct random numbers. You are Dr. Rainder 0B and you have a selection of random numbers from 0 to 9. This? You have two chances to choose the correct number, which you will see in. This seems like a Dora the Explorer level of hacking. What's the random numbers that will make the worm that's destroying all the pornography in the world undetectable? One, two, three, catorce, five. Submit your prompts. The seven <laughs> THS age submitted prompt. <laughs> I don't even know what it's really asking me here. Creation come undone submitted prompt. AIPD submitted prompt. Duke 1102 submitted prompt. <laughs> Duke was thinking the same thing, yeah. An instant on screen. Choose now. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 69, 42, 40, 420, 69. <laughs> you go on random.org and generate a random number Miss between Alive 0 and 9. submitted okay. prompt. 69 lol <laughs> lot of 69 okay yeah i mean i don't know which one of these will be right but i'm sure they'll all be right in some way oh and seventh stage going with seven i see what you're doing Uh oh 
did it break? Oh, okay, no. Sometimes it's just laggy. All right, 20 seconds left. 24. I gotta turn down the... I gotta find a better way to uh, update these stream labels. This works, but it's a little, it's a little rough. It just skipped over 13, skipped over 10, 11. Let's see what the refresh just said. Vote for your favorite prompt. Oh yeah, the refresh just said at one second, so I can definitely turn that down a little bit. Hi, <laughs> Boopy. Yeah. Oh. Hello. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to volley it for another choice thing. I just want to make a decision. So it's either seven or sixty-nine. Even though seven wasn't was actually one of the choices. Uh, also, what's up? Sure, why not? Mister Seeker, vote zero. Oh. You guessed the correct number, sixty-nine. There we go. Generating response. You have earned 1,000 points. Congratulations. You guessed the wrong number, 69. What? You have earned no points. You select a random number from 0 to 9. You select a random number from 0 to 9. You select a random number from 0 to 9. You guessed the right number, 69. You have earned 1,000 <laughs> yeah. points. You have successfully guessed wrong. You guessed the wrong number, 69. Uh. You have earned no points. You select a random number from 0 to 9, you select... We broke it, yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold on. We gotta... Uh, okay. We've gotta get out of this right quick. I need some commands for redo and undo. Let me add that. Here we go. Uh, so, to do, add uh, voting options. Submit your prompts. Or undo, redo. Creation come undone, submitted prompt. Retry. Something like that. So the first couple voting options, or the last couple voting options will be like... Duke 1102, submitted prompt. The 7 THS age submitted prompt. Back, redo, retry. Sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. Use your patent pending loop extermination technology. I like that. An instant on screen of Duke, you do. <laughs> you really want to make more choices. Uh, all this random number uh, uh, generation eventually creates a, a black hole of critical mass and starts sucking all the porn within it. Oh, no. Press the DDoS button. <laughs> okay, these are all very good. <laughs> yeah, I always wondered if they're... I mean, it's so not plausible, but, you know... it. In, like, Super Mario World, when they do the end credit skip, where it's just, like, writing code into... I do wonder if there's that for real life that'll just, like, get you into... <laughs> telepathically link you to uh FBI email server or something. I don't know. I know it's not possible, but I like to think it is. Especially if we're living in a simulation, which people think there are. There's got to be some hacks you could do, like just start climbing a tree and then slapping a turtle on the head and then punching a cat and then doing that in some order. Vote for your favorite prompt. Get ultimate numbers. Okay, there you go. Let's start finding a glitch in the matrix. Exactly. There is a subreddit for finding a glitch in the Matrix, but they're all kind of like like birds. If you like photograph them at like a certain FPS, it just looks like they're standing still in the sky.
This is GPT-3, right? This is... This is... Hold on. Ferrisec Dense 13B. So... This is a model trained by Mr. Seeker for Cobalt AI. So... Uh, All this random number generation eventually creates a black hole of critical mass and starts sucking all porn within it. Generating response. Oops. Into a singularity of infinite amount of empty space, crushing all life forms, leaving only the digital format of porn in its wake and making all the porn digital in our computers. This is the future of all porn and I am the worm. Goodbye porn. Dr. Reinder 0B, you have created a worm that will erase all porn from the internet. Oh no! However, you have accidentally made the worm undetectable. Now the worm will have a choice. Accidentally? We very intentionally did. That was what the random number picking was all about. So we've created a, a ultra-dense porn sphere? crushing all life forms jesus so now there's only the matrix left submit there's, your prompts there's a super massive black hole that's all porn that's probably like the size of a marble and then there's uh, the matrix so there's nfts floating around with uh vr chat and metaverse people sure why not oh, oh, oh submitted prompt <laughs> Duke 1102 submitted prompt. I don't know what to do. Now the worm will have a choice. Yeah. Oh, okay. There you go. Duke's got it. Yeah. Give the worm some choices. Create countless new fetishes. Become a religion. Do nothing at all. Okay. Uh. Create a new wholesome... Missile Life submitted World prompt. Creation come undone submitted prompt. The 7 THS age submitted prompt. You should make it so people AIPD can't vote for their submitted own prompt. prompt. Mm. I think you can vote for your own prompt. I think when the the numbers hopefully I'm hoping the show will be successful, sure why not? And that one vote won't really matter too much. Uh, so hopefully once it gets, we get more people watching more people, I do have a way to get rid of like low quality prompts or if it's just like suck a big dick <laughs> and like, it's just like, that's just not part of the story. So I, ha I do have a way to remove prompts, but, uh, I think one vote in the grand scheme of things won't make too much of a difference. If you want to vote for yourself. Go right ahead. Vote I do want to fix prompt. tiebreaker, though, because that means people just are encouraged to spam a prompt really quickly. So I do want to make the tiebreaker random, like random amongst uh, top prompts. Our votes don't matter. No, your votes matter. Your votes matter. Ah. Put porn on VHS because it's warmer than digital porn surrounding... Starting with the award-winning movie 18 Naked Cowboys at Ram Ranch. You decide to destroy Web 3.0 because it's actually porn for CEOs. Whoa. You create a new wholesome world and metaverse. Oh, that was mine, yeah. <laughs> You're awarded an honorary membership to the No Nut Society. Okay. I'll vote for Ram Ranch. Uh, create countless new fetishes. Uh, well. B. Become a religion. C. Do nothing at all. Generating response. Dot. The worm will make its choice at any moment. The worm wants to create countless new fetishes. It has created a new genre of porn. Black holes sucking all porn from the internet and the fetishes <laughs> created by the worm's choices. <laughs> you are the ultimate creator and you have created a hell of a lot of new fetishes. There is no end to your creativity.
But the question remains, are you ready to deal with the consequences? Oh, fuck. If you are tired Yes. Of fuck, yes. So we, we created a black hole of all fetishes in the world to get rid of the fetishes. And that became our fetish. So there's always something, right? There's always something that people can get off to. Even if it's high concept. Uh, beautiful. I, I feel like that's a good end to the story. I, I don't think Submit we can top that. I mean... <laughs> that's just... That's fucking wonderful. What were we even trying to do in the first place? My fetish is inflation... Uh, that's very funny. There's like, um... Duke1102 submitted prompt. I think it was S... S Seth... Seth... Sedek, whatever... I can't even say his channel name. But someone did a review of an inflation game. An inflation furry game. That actually looked quite fun. Where you, like, eat a bunch. And, like... Creation it, come undone submitted prompt. It's worked prompt. into the gameplay. I can't remember what it's called. Hold on, let me look this up. Sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. Tribal Hunter. Here's his review. Uh, but I was laughing quite a lot, and I don't care if it's like a furry game. The hey, seven THS age submitted. If people prompt. can masturbate it to it, and it's a fun game. I'm okay. I don't give a fuck. I think it's hilarious, but it's called the new Kirby game. <laughs> oh, or that. <laughs> yeah, I guess Kirby is also inflationist. Uh, using your right hand as your best buddy, then dot dot dot. Realize you can't get hard anymore without watching a black hole sucking in all the parts, including the award winning movie 18 Naked Cowboys at Ram Ranch. List the new fetishes you created. Yes, let's get that. I think this is the perfect time for a list. Now everyone must be normal vanilla sex. Now everyone must have normal Vote vanilla sex or burst prompt. a nut into a black hole. <laughs> well, that's a fetish in itself. Uh, I want. I want the list. For me, I want the list. Four is very funny too. Eighteen naked cowboys at Ram Ranch is also very funny. 18 Naked Cowboys at Ram Ranch. I'm just excited to see what it comes up with. This might get very graphic. This might be TOS, but... Uh, this is a worthy sacrifice. Now I feel bad for removing your prompt earlier, Misha. I feel like there's certain words we can't... I don't know. Every time I say that, I regret saying it. I don't want... the new fetishes you created. Yes, here we go. Generating response. Black holes sucking all porn from the internet. We know. You are now a deity that everyone worships. Oh, okay. This has created a new religion called the God of Porn, oh, which makes yes. you their ultimate god and has also made you even more famous. You have created the next big thing, internet porn. You have created an alternative to porn that can now be accessed at any time from any location. Porn is now cheap, available in unlimited amounts and almost completely free. The downside. The downside, absolute depravity from everybody in the universe. This is the exact opposite of what we didn't want to happen. I think we were trying to destroy, destroy the porn, not become the porn. Anakin, you were supposed to defeat the porn, not become the porn. It assumes Submit great dildo diller form, yeah. Also, if Kirby accidentally shows the dingus donger, does it inherit where did... <laughs> yeah, I guess if you swallow any... Yeah, Kirby... I mean, there's some stuff that Kirby can transform into. Sometimes he just sucks up a little dude. You Creation have become the very thing you sought to destroy. Prompt. Exactly. Duke 1102 submitted prompt. Start a company called MindGeek. 
All humans are now addicted to porn and no longer have sure, social interactions whatsoever. Prompt. That's also possible. When everything is porn, the nothing is. The THS age submitted uh, prompt. Demons called Succubi have Missile now invaded our world. Prompt. In search of our immaculate porn. <laughs> the birth rates become so low that humans are nearly extinct. Ooh, I like that. Interesting, too. Interesting lore. I'm going to abstain from voting this this round. I can't pick one. I can't pick one from these. They're all too good. They're all very similar. In the future, all porn will be AI generated. I That's an actual thing I think will happen. Yes. Because already with like images and like stable diffusion had like uh, some, uh, you know seductive level uh outputs which i feel like open ai suppressed but uh yeah i feel like it's already starting to happen Th there is so much training data too but also Vote i for do your favorite prompt i do feel like it's trained off of existing data so i still think there'll be non-ai porn but maybe just to feed in new training data for the ai i do think ai generated porn will be a huge business like as soon as you can get like as soon as we have like animation i mean that's gonna be that's gonna take off there's gonna be ai hentai sites all up in this place well i guess there could be ai hentai right now but i don't even think dojins will be generated designer is so much better yeah uh but i could see like when it gets to a level of where it's like i want to see like i don't know who's someone like super up there like i'm waiting for ais to be able to generate 3d models that you can use in the in-game engine oh that's very interesting too duke demons called succubi now have invaded our world in search of our immaculate porn okay generating response you have created an alternative to porn that can now be accessed at any time from any location Porn is now cheap, available in unlimited amounts and almost completely free. The downside of all this is the demons called succubi now have invaded our world in search of our immaculate porn. What did you say? That's impossible. You just told them where to find it. They can't get here that quickly. But they're here now. And they are hungry. <laughs> I feel like this is the start of something. Looping. A little bit looping. It added a little bit though, sure. So it's not completely looping. But I feel like, yeah, we're about to start a new story. There's got to be a new story soon. I, you know what? I think that's a good end. The succubi are here, and uh, they're hungry for porn. New story time. Submit your prompts. Oops, sorry. Yeah. All right, now you can submit prompts. Oh, wait, hold on. N no prompts yet. How, d how do you know if porn... Isn't AI generated already? Whoa, that's steep, Misha. I, I don't know that, I guess. Uh, <laughs> that would be insane. All right. Submit your prompts. Here you go. New story. Let me save the old story real quick here. Duke 1102 submitted prompt. Uh, I guess we could call that porn black hole. Creation come undone submitted prompt. You are a farting fish. The pond you live in is beautiful, but all other fish are always dying when you release a massive fart. Okay. You are Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior of mankind, or so they think. Okay, coming back with that. Pornhole. Oh, there we go. Hi, what's up, Eucharivis? You Uh, What's going on? We're telling stories here. This is like an AI storytelling stream, but you could submit prompts and stuff. 
You can submit prompts. You can vote for prompts. And uh, an AI will generate uh, part of the story. So just telling the story with an AI, pretty much. I'm upstating. Uh, exclamation, exclamation prompt to submit a prompt. Uh, and then at the end of Missile the round, we'll vote. submitted prompt. There we go. How fairest thou this day? Uh, it's an overcast day here in Michigan. I'm listening while playing Ghostwire Tokyo. Uh, I have not heard of Ghostwire Tokyo. What Vote kind of game is it? Favorite prompt. You are Jason. One day you're mistaken for Dave Grohl and have to perform at Madison Square Garden. Oh my god, I would be terrified. I don't... I would just be immediately booed. I would be immediately discovered. Like, if I looked exactly like him, I don't know. I would just be instant... I would have so much anxiety. I would come up with some excuse to cancel the show. I would be like, I cannot. I don't know why you think I am. It was half off for a bit. FPS was ghost and shit. Interesting. Hmm. Farting fish. Here we go. I want to see farting fish. You are a farting fish. The pond you live in is beautiful, but all the other fish are always dying when you release a massive fart. Interesting. Generating response. There are no specific blogs for PKL5A, but you can read our latest blog posts. Be the first to review our PKL5A antibody and receive a gift card or what discount. The, the one, the only, the iconic walrus purchasing the right mattress is the most important factor when considering buying what? a new bed. This is your sleeping area and will affect the support and comfort of the rest of your body. What? Jackie TH. What? Boo, it's an ad. Yeah, what the fuck? Shit and ghosts and FPS? <laughs> A farting fish, the one and only iconic walrus. Why did it say that? Why did it talk about walruses? Sponsored by Casper, yeah. Upgrade the shit out of your anti -blo your ad blocker, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, you see a fat ass walrus named Walter. Try to out fart you in your own creation pond. come undone submitted prompt AIPD submitted prompt install an underwater air ad blocker yeah I don't yeah it must be the training data or something I don't know what's what caused an ad to start playing. Missile Life submitted prompt. Omogona 22 submitted prompt. Mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You realize Chase is taking any sponsorship for money. Become fat. Okay. Is that implying that fat people have stinkier farts? I mean, I guess I can't disprove. Vote for your favorite prompt.
Uh, I will be right back. Be good. You see a fat ass walrus named Walter try to out fart you in your own pond. Generating response. Walrus don't breathe oxygen, but walrus do live underwater and have gills. His breath may only be food, but it's still better than yours. Your throne is majestic, you have learned how to speak walrus, you're so famous, you're recognized in public. Hey Walter, how's it going? I'm Lloyd and I like to eat wood. You're kicked out of your pond by the government because you stink you stink to you. Oh shit, okay. Walruses don't breathe oxygen, but walruses do live underwater and have gills. His breath may be only for food, but it's better than yours. Your throne is majestic. You've so learned how to speak walrus. You're so famous. Submit you're your prompts. Whoa. Hi, Walter. I'm Lloyd, and I'd like to eat wood. You're kicked out of your pond by government because you stink. You stink too, you. What? What the fuck? How did it all fall apart instantly? Creation this come undone. Submitted prompt. This walrus got us evicted from our own pond! <laughs> sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. You tell Walter, put your dick away, Walter. I'm not having sex right now, Walter. Put your gun away, Walter. Lloyd is a. <laughs> Lloyd is diagnosed the seven with Bart Gill. The 7THS age submitted has, prompt. Oh, so sad. He has months to live. I am the Eggman. I am the Walrus. Goo 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 choo. Uh, two exclamation points. Uh, your. Your Vecchies. I know that's a little bit confusing, but. You have an addiction to these nuts jokes. Every time you write these nuts, your lifespan shortens by five years. Oh, two back to back. Oh, sorry. I got you. Here, I'll put it in for you. Yervik submitted prompt. Oh, there you go. You got it. You got it. No spaces. Yeah. I do like the beam response. Vote for your favorite prompt. Okay. <laughs> I do like putting some stakes on here too. I see you're living a healthy maximum sugar intake lifestyle. Yeah. Hey, I didn't get this for me. <laughs> Alan brought it for me. What am I saying? I'm fat. I know it. I want Lloyd to have his lowest point, and then we can start building him back up. Start puffing, boy. Hey, thanks for the follow. You tell Walter, put your dick away, Walter. I'm not having sex with you right now, Walter. <laughs> Generating response. All right.
Walter Walter decides to be your lover instead and he farts you all the time. I can't believe we're having sex with each other. I just love farting you so much, you smell so sweet. Walter, Walter, Walter Walter you're so fat you fart yourself you fart yourself the fat walrus blows you write a book, the <laughs> fat walrus. Our secrets revealed, it becomes. <laughs> the fat walrus our secrets revealed, okay. Well, this is taking the turn. From a farting fish. I guess we haven't strayed too far from the... So we're a farting fish and we're having sex with Walrus to Walter, who's also a farting walrus. And uh, we wrote a book about it, I guess? I don't know. Submit your prompts. I guess that, go that goes to show you, if you're having writer's block, anybody can write a book. A farting fish can write a book about blowing a walrus. I walk away for 10 minutes and absolute chaos reigns. Yep. Uh, that's pretty accurate. Hey, what's up, Ryan? <laughs> this story has gotten off the rails. A l just a little bit. Um, I'm taking a phone apart right sure, now. Sure, why but... not? Oh, 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 submitted oh, prompt. Fancy. You do phone repair? That always fast. I watch... Uh... Who's that one guy in New York who just moved away from New York and he did like New York real estate videos for a little bit? Ah, uh, what's his name? I like that guy's videos. I don't do phone repair myself, but I like, it's very like, oh, okay. Lewis Rossman. Yeah, Rossman Repair Group. Yeah. Sure, why not? Thank you. You're on it. Yeah. Ross my balls. <laughs> you read the reviews for your tell all fart book. Okay. Creation come undone submitted prompt. AIPD submitted prompt. Uh, you self-published the book, The Fal Walrus, Our Secrets Revealed, as an ebook on Amazon. In the book, you reveal all the steamy secrets about your wal about walrus fart sex. Okay. Vote for your favorite prompt. Yeah, I, I imagine you'd have some difficulty trying to find a publisher for The Fat Walrus. Fart so big it blows a hole in your trousers. You know what? I should make the commands just easier to, to type out for our mobile friends. Because exclamation, exclamation, prompts. Yeah. I don't know why I made it so complicated. Let me make a note of that. Hold on. To do, make, entering, prompts, and votes easier. And I guess since it changes per round, it doesn't have to, it doesn't really matter if it's overlaps with another thing. I just have to make sure. Yeah. You it's read just the unique. reviews for your tell all fart book. Okay. Here we Generating go. Generating response. They're mostly bad. Fart book fans, I will never understand your fascination with the wild and rude worlds of barf and poop. But if you enjoy the literary equivalent of smelling a fart, then enjoy. Hated the book. You get your revenge <laughs> by farting book. at your enemies. You use your newfound fame to fart at your enemies. You'll use the money from your book to finance your life of farting and hilarity. You fart when. All right. Mostly bad. Also, there's a social network called Fart Book Fans. Hey, it's about farting. It's not about barf and poop. Don't you put words in my book's mouth, okay? Uh, and no, on no page do I ever talk about barfing and pooping. That's what you put. That's what your mind went to. This is just about a simple fart. Okay? Submit your prompts. Creation come undone. Submitted prompt. Uh, oh, whoa. Empty prompt. 
I don't know what that'll do. Oops. Yeah, I I guess it didn't submit a prompt. So I think you should be good to submit another prompt creation. Prompt is actually kind of good, but if you want to change it and keep the word in case of autocorrect. Oh, that's a good point, too. Sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, did we break something? Oh, yes, we did. Uh-oh. All right, you should be able to submit again, creation. Uh, fix bug. The seven THS age submitted prompt. Creation come undone submitted prompt. Did I break it? Not really. You broke the display thing for it, but I think it's fine now. So easy fix, easy fix. Uh, you should be able to do an empty prompt, though, to continue. So in a way, just saying exclamation and exclamation prompt should be valid. But Oh, here, let's see if I can fix it for you. You reckon this? Oh, Your you got it in. Submitted prompt. Oh, there you go. You got right you, uh, the buzzer beater. Vote for your favorite prompt. Wow, that's great. I was cheering for you. <laughs> you win a Nobel Prize for helping people around the world be comfortable with farting. Oh, I like that. Only farts. Create a shitty Netflix live action movie about your fart fighters. <laughs> you began work on the HBO adaptation of your fart novel. I don't know if you could win in your the Nobel Peace Prize for a fart, but we're sure gonna try. Can anyone access this program? Uh, it's technically open source YS books. It's something I made though, so if anybody else got this to work on their machines. I'd be very surprised. Uh, I I have to work on the documentation for a lot, but it, right now it's a you very win a Nobel Prize for helping people around the world thing. be comfortable with so. farting. But generating response to answer your question, why us books? You fart on the audience during your acceptance speech. Thank you for your love of farting and for giving me the opportunity to fart freely. The fat walrus blows. You fart when your library museum is built in your honor. Whoa! For your love of farting, this is how much I love you. I built you a museum. Fartington, you fart at the opening of the museum library. As we open our... You didn't use self-documenting code? Shame. Hey. Too real. Hey, when you're hacking something together, you're just trying to get it working. I'm in an ad, so I can't hear the answer. Okay, I'll answer when you're out of the ad. Uh, YS Books, are you out of the ad yet? Let me know. And I'll answer you. Submit your prompts. I do. Uh, I've been trying to stream like every day, Eurekovis. Yeah. Eurovix. Eurovix. Uh, I can't say it. Hey, what's up, Prince? You can call me Vix. All right. I will do that. Thank you. The 7 THS age submitted prompt.
Creation come undone submitted prompt. Uh, I should try to make this so other people can sure, use it. Sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. Right now, I just got it working yesterday, so low priority. First, first priority is making sure that this is fun. If it gets some attention, though, I will put in the work to... I like starting a cult. Vote for your the favorite prompt. The farting shit museum burns down after a gas explosion. Novel AI is not in my budget. Okay. Yeah, but free trial runs out and he doesn't want to make like 100 emails. Because then you could get banned from that if they figure out what's going on. Uh, I wish Novel AI had a free tier. But yeah, Cobalt AI. Let's see. Cobalt AI is free. It just is, it takes a while to load. But if free, if, if your only inhibitor is free, then I guess you can spend the time to... I heard they were considering it. That would be, that would blow up if it, if they had a free tier. Don't want to confirm anything. Start though. a cult called Fartology and recruit the celebrity Tom Sphincter for it. Yes. Generating response. Create an army of fat walruses that wear t shirts saying, Fuck yeah, Fartology. <laughs> yeah! You fart in your own museums, books, you fart in your own living room. You fart in your own ass. A hippie biker walks into your house and walks all over your collection of antique farting machines. Uh, oh my god, He yeah. stops when he sees your TV playing the greatest fart video ever. What the fuck is this? He asks you. There we go. That's a moment. Uh, Cobalt AI. Uh, that's a free version of like... AI dungeons essentially. They have a Discord that'll help you out get it set up. It is a little strange to set up if you're submit your prompts. But uh that's what this is running off of, so if you're curious and if money is an issue, this is a this is a way around that. If they add a free tier, they will have to display ads to make it sustainable. Yeah, I guess that's the double-edged sword. Missile life submitted prompt. Sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. Become the president of the U.S. Do your pro farting ideas. I mean, if we. Uh, Farting is popular, I guess, if we've accumulated a following of fat walruses. Yervik submitted prompt. The world begins to hate you. Oh, that's also a possibility. We found everybody that likes farting and everybody else fucking hates it. You explained the greatest fart video and your thought process behind it. Okay. I do like the world turning on this. This is kind of like... We started our own version of Jonestown, Fartstown, and uh, we like someone like seals the door shut and all our farts create a to toxic atmosphere and we all die. Or we go to the moon and live in a happy fart utopia where we farted in space and nobody dies. Either way, I don't know. Who knows where this is going? I feel like Vote I feel like the world's got to hate us. Yeah. Uh, 
I'm going cynical. We need some ad- we need some uh, strife in the story. We need we need some obstacle to overcome, and I think it's people's hatred of farting. I had a fart. And it was good. I want to live in a world where farting could be acceptable. The world begins hate you. Generating response. Dot. The fat walrus blows, quote dot. The fartological legion of the fat walrus is born. Oh my god, that's amazing! Mandrager, the juggernaut of Farsham and the juggalo of Farsham. <laughs> fart, the fat walrus blows. You produce the greatest fart video ever and show it on every TV in the world. This becomes a hit and you go on a world tour. What? What? The fartological legion of the fat walrus is a fucking... If you have a D&D &D campaign, there you go. Submit your prompts. Um, and also fartium, is that like a, a fart is a basic element? A fart, is that a turd? <laughs> I mean, uh, is it a new periodic table of elements? We farted so much that we've created like a radioactive isotope fart. And also Earl Lervick Manberger. submitted prompt. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's how we build up. We we get we can't start in the US. You preach your farthing ideas in schools around Asia. Yeah. I think that's that's how we grow as a, they don't know to fear us yet. But the US is definitely onto our fart bullshit. Sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. Oh, here we go. AIPD submitted prompt. Now a world-renowned leader of the fart space innovation, you fart off into the sunset. Yeah, I feel like we're reaching a conclusion. I mean, we've, we're have we so close to the fart sun. We don't want to explode. Vote for your favorite prompt. I will abstain. Any one of these could be our uh, epilogue for the story. And then we'll start a new story. The next <laughs> fart into the sun. How nice. I don't even remember where we started. We're okay. I guess we farting stuck through the whole time. We were a farting fish. We got kicked out of our swamp. We formed an alliance with the farting walrus, I guess. We got it romantically involved, and then it all went downhill from there. Now, a world renowned leader of fart space innovation, you fart off into the sunset. Okay.
generating response. Suddenly, you hear a large, echoing fart. The fat walrus blows. Quote dot. The fat walrus blows. Your fart becomes the ending theme for every film. You fart when there is a rash of murders of pizza delivery men in your city. You find out there's a group of pizza delivery boys whose goal is to rip your butt apart with their bare hands. They wear team colors of red and black. What? That's not fair. What the hell? Pizza delivery boys hate us? A gang, a roaming gang of pizza delivery boys. That is quite the subculture of a subculture. Submit your prompts. Uh, you know what? Yeah, I guess we'll start a new story. I hate that the pizza boys got away with it. Actually, hold on. One more. Life of a fart fish, yeah. You make the pizza delivery boys regret ever messing Yervik submitted prompt with <laughs> Pizza delivery boys are Russian spies? AIPD submitted prompt. The, the Okay, the pizza delivery boys need to pay. They can't just tear our ass apart. We are the leader of a cult, okay? We can't just be walked over by pizza delivery boys. You can't start an awesome religion and then immediately get beat up by local ruffians. That's not how the world works, okay? You need to get revenge. It's like, it's almost a... An ob a societal obligation that you have to fight back, right? What's next? A baby's gonna start beating me up? You gotta draw the line somewhere, okay? We weren't even doing anything. Are they blaming us for the murders of pizza delivery boys? The rise of the fart religion? It seems ve like very misplaced aggression. Are you on YouTube as well? I am. Sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. Vote for your favorite prompt. Uh, here's our YouTube channel, YS Books. You merely smile, raising your arms to some of your legion of fart fans who swarm the pizza mercs and fart them to death. Oh, there you go. Yeah, here we go. Uh, YS Books, this is uh, a very, very new format of the show. Before we did, like, uh, a less interactive show. It was still very interactive, but we have many, many videos of us playing uh, Cobalt AI, Novel AI, and AI Dungeon from way back in the day. From basically when the each of them was formed. So it's an interesting uh, little time capsule. If you do a video on how to set up Cobalt AI, I would watch. You know what? I will you do You merely smile, raising your arms to summon your legion of fart fans who swarm the pizza mercs and fart them to death. Generating response. The I will do that, Wyatt's blows. books. You fart when the president calls you president of the fart core. Dot. Oh, thank you, sir. I'm very honored. Well, you don't smell very good. Get out of my office. <laughs> no, sir. No, sir, please. Please don't be angry, sir. I apologize for my stench. I'm going to the spa right now and I'll have an appointment with a surgeon. What? <laughs> Uh, when you need to get surgery for your stench? I just showered, sir. Hey, what's up, Link F? I've been here before. I have 470 channel points. I just never chatted before. Ah, okay. Well, welcome back. All right. I think that's a good end to the fart core. We formed an army division of farting. Submit your prompts. All right, here we go. New story starting. 
Uh, so if you're just watching, this is Adventure Bot. Uh, we're playing Cobalt Day es essentially, but it's with too much chat. So you get to each round, we'll have uh, submitting a prompt, then uh, voting for the prompt. Whatever the top prompt is gets sent to Cobalt AI, it generates a response. And uh, we loop until we reach a nice conclusion in the story. So here we go. New story starting up. Submit and your prompts. Exclamation, exclamation, prompt, and then your prompt to submit a prompt. And then, uh, then we vote on. And yeah, it's pretty simple, right? I don't know. Does it need more explanation? Essentially, we're just telling an adventure story with a AI. So, if you're not familiar, it's kind of like, yeah, AI dungeon, D and D lores, huh? I see. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, it's yeah, a little bit like it's like D and D with a dungeon master AI, and we're doing it with Trat. So, lot of lot of concepts going on, but. The premise is pretty simple, or the, the actual execution of it is simple. And that last one, we were a farting fish. It's also fun. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, and this is K9000. So. And I'm Jason. I just try to keep things on the rails. But K9000 is the brains. They're the DM, yeah. We're like co-DMs. <laughs> oh, nobody's submitting a prompt? Uh, you could, anybody could submit. There's no like limitation or nothing. Love the love those doggos, yeah. Uh, if no one submits a prompt, it'll just go on to the next thing. So we could do like, uh, sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. Oh, got one in there, Submit right? At, your prompts uh, right at the end there. Omogona 22 submitted prompt. Cheese man, you are Jack Jacked, a muscular, a massively muscular farmer. While working in the fields one day, you are abducted by a flying saucer. Okay. Or, uh, here. Uh. You are... AIPD submitted prompt. Oh, you can still submit a prompt. Yeah, sorry. It did, it did not skip over to the next round because there was no prompts and they submitted right at the end. So it is still submit your prompts round. I should make a make it different, look different a little bit. So it's not so similar to the voting round. Yervik submitted prompt. Ah. Keeping it simple, you're a serial killer. Uh, anybody want to submit the prompt? Uh, you already got his prompt in there, Almagona. So, limit one per user. Anybody else? Last minute prompt? Fuck caps. Yeah. Vote for your favorite prompt. All right, now we're voting. So, yeah. <laughs> it's right on screen, Amagona. Cheese, man. Uh, I do love the abduction story. Oh, too late. Hey, what's up, Duke?
Yeah, you don't want to mess with a farm boy. But I guess if you're an alien. Are you really going to be picky about who, the people you abduct? Hmm? I don't think so. You are Jack Jacked, a massively muscular farmer. All right. While working in the fields one day, you are abducted by a flying saucer. Okay. Generating response. Oh my god, what the fuck? The extraterrestrials, known as the ugly people, <laughs> believe that the Earth is being threatened by a race of giant insects called the Hyrids, who are in fact men in costume, and think that by training you in their craft, you can help them stop the invasion. Jack, your intrepid Earth-saving intergalactic pilot, then takes you back to their home planet, which is actually an enormous cave-like structure inhabited by up to a million of the Man cave! All right, Jack Jack. A lot, lots going on here. We got the ugly people, so they're schizos. It's all a case of mistaken identity. But actually, the ugly people are the extraterrestrials. They think they're being threatened by a race of giant insects who are also just weird, like, uh, exterminator. Submit your prompts. I, yeah, I don't know what's... Still phone repairing. Uh, love when manufacturers glue them in shut. Yeah, I hate that. You have to take a heat gun to a battery, which is never a good. It just seems like uh, risky business. I remember hearing when like Apple started doing that, like gluing in RAM and shit, so you couldn't upgrade easy without buying a whole new MacBook. I was like, fuck that. But it's become like the new standard, unfortunately. Just very annoying. Sure, why not? Oh, 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 submitted prompt. AIPD <laughs> submitted prompt. You say a redneck one liner and criticized aliens' farming techniques. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's start some shit. <laughs> let's stir the shit pot with uh, these uh, mascots. At least our iPhones, they glue them in, but with a latch to get them easy out. And nah, no heat gun, thin plastic to slide under it. Oh, that's even an more annoying. Yeah, I guess you wouldn't want to heat up a battery or that could go very sideways and if that doesn't work put in a few drops of isopropyl alcohol okay interesting i'm always fascinated i only know software like i could do like basic computer upgrades and stuff but if anything like serious breaks i can't solder so i'm fucked I should. I really want to learn how to solder just so I know, because I feel like that could solve Vote a lot of things. Vote for your favorite prompt. All right, I want to hear this alien one-liner or this red knuck one-liner. You might be a big alien insect. You might be a redneck if. You think bug people are aliens in costumes. You might be a redneck if. You can learn there are kits to make your own radio too, at least old Radio Shack times. I did that before. There was like, I can't remember what it was called, but it was like, it was like a big board and it had like, uh, just a bunch of wires and uh, they were like different lengths. A mortal redneck is free on you good old games. You say a redneck one-liner oh, and criticize the aliens' farming techniques. Generating response. Jack asks if you are ready to fight the Hyrids. We are too late. The Hyrids have already conquered the planet. A Hyrid warrior asks if you have any last words. You look at Jack and say, you gotta be kidding me, man. Wait, how could you be too late? We were supposed to return on Sunday. It's Thursday. Yeah, that's how all vacations are. With that, the... 
You gotta be kidding me, man. Okay, so it's like a sitcom one-liner. Not really the best one-liner. You wouldn't be able to fix anything on the monitor computer, even if you could solder. Okay, well. I mean, I feel like it's a good skill to know still. True, tiny SMD. Just need a magnifying gas and precision tools. And I do not have precision hands. Oh, uh, thank you, sure, prompt. why not? I've just got a mortal redneck. I have no idea what it is, but it's free, so. All right, so we're being killed by an insect man, but he's just wearing... Okay, hold on. I got it. We Scooby-Doo this shit. Uh, you rip the mask off the hybrid warrior, revealing him to be human. AIPD submitted prompt. It's more of a catchphrase, yeah. You gotta be kidding me, man! Oh, it looks like an old school FPS, prompt. but with nicer graphics. Interesting. I do like the boomer shooters. I never finished them, but I do like to play on a... a Sunday afternoon. Yervik submitted prompt. You turn into a sussy baka man. Jack dies and his Giga Chad brother Thomas goes on a rampage. Okay. Also, it takes place in Egypt somehow. Interesting. Okay. I'm very curious. Uh, 20 le seconds left to submit a prompt. If you want to submit a prompt, exclamation, exclamation, prompt. And then whatever after that. And anybody can. And then we vote on it. So don't worry if you submit something and you're like, ah, that wasn't that good. You can get it in. Vote for your favorite prompt. You never know where the AI is going to take it. So something even simple and innocuous could turn into something funny. It's a roguelite. Oh, interesting. I'm going to download it right now. So, 2017. All right, here we go. Jack dies and his G-I-G-A-C-H-A-D brother Thomas goes on a rampage. Okay. Generating response. But is eventually defeated by Laughing Ben, a Hyrid warrior that is clearly suffering from chronic indigestion. <laughs> the Hyrids then continue their conquest of the galaxy. Your soul is carried up to heaven, where you discover that all the other people in heaven have been forced to spend eternity worshipping the Three Stooges. What? You scream, and are then crushed by the weight of the Three Stooges' ego. Jack dies in an explosion as... What? <laughs> Did they have a huge ego? Your soul is... Okay, so heaven exists. The three stooges... Damn, is that a good thing or bad thing? You have to worship the three stooges? Uh, that doesn't sound like heaven to me. Um, <laughs> Submit your prompts. Wow, what in the hell just happened? Laughing, Ben. All right, so we're dead. I guess the problems of Earth aren't our concern anymore. Now our, our we have a new enemy has appeared. The Three Stooges, and they're I guess heaven has made them incredibly egotistical. You know, I bet I bet the Three Stooges were probably I don't know. I can't say. There's no, 
it's not like it is how it is now. I guess if you wanted to li live a secret life back then. I mean, does anybody know sure, anything about not? the Three oh, Stooges oh, outside prompt. of their act? Like, Duke 1102 submitted prompt. It's not like there's daytime television interviews with the Three Stooges or something that we can go back and watch. Like, they only existed as the Three Stooges. Like, you sigh and with your dying breath, I knew this would happen. One of the Three Stooges violently cooms. AIPD submitted prompt. I never thought I would write that sentence, but that's the magic of the AI here. It makes me think like that. Never thought I would team up with God for anything, but the three stooges are clearly on a on a bender, a power a power kip, an ego ego trip. They must be stopped. Yervik submitted prompt. Vote for your favorite prompt. Uh, the Three Stooges are taken on by the Three Musketeers in an epic battle on a planet called Chocolate. Oh, I like that. I guess this is just a mortal regnet now. Uh. Three Stooges versus the Three Musketeers? Uh-oh. Open AI saying something shouldn't be saying. Farts that or fart tax. You Proud supporters of the vagina. The three Stooges. This site is Generating for all things response. ass. Interesting. Thomas comes to the edge of heaven and asks why you have not come to help him. Okay. I have, but you keep shooting at me with your cannons, and I get kind of annoyed when people shoot at me. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. With that, Thomas turns around and shoots you with his cannons, and you are both flung into the fiery pit of hell. The end. You get murdered by a murderous three-legged cow. God asks if you... The fuck? Uh, okay, I think we're approaching two hours here. I think this is a good place to stop. Yeah, wait, here we go. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoy the new format. Let me know what you want. Uh, exclamation Discord. Which I know is confusing with the double exclamation for everything else. Anyway. I'll adjust that. Join the Discord. Uh, tell me what you want added. Hang out. Share your AI creations. We do a lot of AI image sharing, story sharing. Do what you want. And, um, yeah. Yeah. Give me a follow if you like the stream. Tell people. And yeah, see you next time. I'll be on tomorrow. Probably a little bit later. Well, actually, oh, tomorrow is Labor Day. So uh, we will see. I might be on at noon again. We'll figure it out. Join the Discord and find out when I'm going live. Uh, bye, Hobie Way, everyone. See you next time.